Welcome back to System Shock. We're going around destroying all four antennas so Shodan can't upload herself to Earth. We've destroyed one so far. Next one I'm going to hit up is Alpha. Um, before that, though, I do want to explain that I did some running around off camera because I was thinking about this message that we got on this level. It says, if we can take down the CPUs on levels 1 through 6, we can get the digits of the system's authorization code. Then we stand a chance. And that made me think about the fact that I remember seeing these weird panels with numbers on them around the CPU nodes and had no idea what they were about. So I went around to each destroyed CPU node on every floor, one through six. And yeah, each of the nodes has one or more monitors around it that displays one digit. So six digits in total with all six floors. I wrote them all down. Uh, there was one missing though, the one on maintenance. Well, we haven't even found the CPU node on maintenance. So I'm guessing something happens with that later. But um, yeah, I have five of the digits, and if I had to, I could probably just brute force the last digit. Hopefully I won't have to. I also went back to the library on the research level, and I wrote down the laser safety override code, which I'm pretty sure we used forever ago. Just because when I was looking at a walkthrough at one point, trying to figure out what to do next, it mentioned something about that code being important for the end of the game, and it said you should write it down somewhere and keep it. So... I wrote it down. We'll see if it see if it comes in handy. Oh, I don't have any power left. Which means I can't float over there. Okay, is Shodan gonna pull the same trick as before and lock me in there with the explosive? Let's just go for it. Book it. I don't know how far away we have to be. This should be fine. Two of four. Don't suppose it. Dropped anything? No. Can I make it just by sprinting? No. Wait. Oh, there's a ladder. <laughs> that helps. I really don't like having no power because I can't use my item finder, so I could be missing stuff. Hello? Come on. No. I don't think I can really get up there without the boots. Let's explore where the voice is. Letting go is best. Immortal. Ooh. 
Wait, do I already have that? Engineering card? I'm not sure. Would it show the animation if I already had it? Died snacking. That's how I want to go out. Oh, there's something up there. Okay, I need to mark this. Item. Need. Power. Why am I in all caps? Nine shots for that, that's not very good. Two shots for this, that's not very good. How many Teflon rounds do I have for this? Full magazine, nice. Uh, in that case, do I have fleshy shots for this? Yes. That's interesting. Is that button gonna open it? Yeah. Don't know if I... Well... Don't know if I want to drop down there. Oh. Oh yeah, that's the right weapon. Yes! Okay, oh, hello. Turbo Motion Boots V3. What do I have right now? Increase the vertical thrust of the jump system. Oh, hell yeah! It already felt like I could get so much air. Even more? Whoa! That's a lot more! You could pretty much reach any vertical thing you see at all. Oh, there was a place that had an item really high up that I could see on the mini-map, and I remember thinking, like, how do I get it? And I don't remember where it is. I don't mean the one we just found, I mean, like, an episode ago. Probably leading to the area where you can get by falling down through the force field. Yes. I hear voices in there. It's the only way to go. Assessing managerial assets. Hiring replacement employees. 
Cross-referencing. Religious background check. Reviewing taped interviews for threats. Executive run. Level security nine percent. Battery pack, sweet. Those have been in short supply for a long time. Is this a, a thing? Not really. Can't interact with it. It looks super cool though. I need to be even more aware of the vertical, the, the verticality of a level now, because I can go really high up. My children, the security level is to be laid out in this manner and no other. First, remove the lower elevator that provides access to the a a access to the bridge and my domain. Second, the balconies and force bridges shall all be re 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 removed, save for one to the central shaft, where all incoming life forms shall be monitored. It's cool that there's a in-world explanation for why it's so difficult to get around this ship. Like, why isn't there an elevator that just goes up and down through the entire ship, all levels? Why is it like you can only go a couple levels and then you have to switch to a different elevator? It's very weird. That's on purpose. Because Shodan's trying to make it difficult. Wait, where is this? That's a, that's a whole different thing. Yeah, I don't think I want to explore that yet. Let's continue from here, where we got the V3 of the boots. Actually, let's go back slightly and get that item that I needed energy for. Flechette rounds. Oh, nice. That's for these. Okay, haven't been here. Are we done with the Alpha Quadrant? We've done everything in the Alpha Quadrant except this here. So yeah, back up here now. Oh, before we go to that area on the far right, now that I have power, I can go here. Yeah, not much there at all. how cool that is. I just love all the esoteric machinery. What is this for? This looks like a something that belongs on a milling machine. Wait, there's ammo here. Flechette rounds. Oh, for the shotgun that I'm using right now. Perfect. Yeah. 
I've gotten a lot of ammo for the Magnum. I'm not actually carrying the Magnum. But it is in the lift. My children, you di you disappoint me. A single in 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 insect continues to slip through the cracks. I have given you augmented senses, armor, and cybernetic enhancements. And, 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 and yet, you fail me. They crawl closer, and I will not have my sanctum breached. Move your mistakes. And protect my altar, my children. I've pissed them off so much that they're starting to lash out at their subordinates. That's a good sign. Wait a second. Is this... It needs a switch. Oh, never mind. I thought this was a secret door being highlighted for the first time. Since we got the upgrade that says it will show secret doors. It does show a door, but I think it's just a normal door. That just needs a switch to activate it. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Look at the map here. The minimap shows just like this weird little offshoot on the wall, almost like a partially ajar door. It's really subtle. Is that indicating a secret door? Because that does look a little bit suspicious. That's not what it means. What is it? That's really, really weird. a storage room? Oh, tons of batteries. Oh my god, 20 Magpuls cartridges? Some railgun projectiles? Just a crap ton of ammo. Whoa, a hundred! Or, no, sorry, 50 Teflon coated rounds and 50 normal rounds. That's really good! 72 Penetrator rounds! Damn! An entire assault rifle if I needed it. Wow. Alright, what? What is that? RW45 Energy Efficiency Mod Kit. RW45. Wait, is that... Oh yeah, that's the Ion Pulse Rifle. Oh, hell yeah! Upgrades it, reduces energy cost. Um, is there a way for me to quantify that? I think so. So right now it's on overcharge, the highest one. Energy used is 70 joules. Now the energy used is 60 joules. Okay, modest improvement. Didn't I pick up Teflon rounds for this? Oh, did I not have room for that? Oh, wow. Oh, okay, well, I don't need that. I think I need to clear my inventory space. Let's go with the penetrator rounds for the assault rifle. And then I'll use standard rounds for this. Ooh, 
Looks like we've looped around to where the teleporter terminates. There's a body above me in the, like, main... What is this called? The core? And I think I can maybe reach it now? Oh, yes! A freaking empty tripop can? Throw that garbage out of here. You gotta be kidding me. So you crawled up here with a can, drank it, and then died? That's... I don't know, that's kind of sad. There's gotta be something up here, right? Or is it just that to mess with me? Oh, Jesus! I'm not sure why I just fell out of the fucking sky. I didn't run out of power. Christ. Um... I can go higher up. I don't see anything on the minimap, though. Oh, Easter egg! Let's explore a Delta Quadrant. By the way, I dropped my Ion Pulse Rifle so I could get some more inventory space. Um, for Delta Quadrant, it says there's a camera down here and it looks partially unexplored. Not sure what happened here. Security is now 5%. There's a sniper. Did I kill the sniper? Got him. Yeah, I think the sniper must be dead. Oh, this is the other end of that lift that has that puzzle that I couldn't solve. Okay, so you don't actually need to solve that. It's just a shortcut, I guess. A secret area up there that I can reach. This is just going to hook up with an area we've already been to. Seems so. Mm, come on! Come on! Oh, you're so close! Oh my god! Okay, so instead of starting from the ground, let's start from the railing. What 
do we got? A couple batteries. Seems to be it. It's nice though. So that's all that. Yeah, let's go check out the Delta antenna, which I think is through here. Enemy on the minimap. Probably only a couple more cameras left. Okay. Let's go for it. Oh, I think I've found the room that had the thing really high up that I couldn't get to. It's here in Gamma Quadrant. More batteries. Okay, yeah, the... Well, one of the last places that I haven't been to is this irradiated zone. In Beta Quadrant. Check it out. Oh, let me make sure my environmental protection pack is on. So that just links up here. I think I missed some stuff back here, though. Energy projectile shield V3 absorbs a maximum amount of damage for proportionally more energy. I still, like, never remember to use that. I think that's it for this area. Ah, okay, here's the door to beta antenna. Just here in the beta quadrant. 
Oh, I also went to the um, cargo lift and I replaced my shotgun with the magnum pistol. We have 12 rounds loaded out of 75 in total, so we have a lot of shots for this. Oh. There's a mine. These might be the remaining cameras. 2%. And... update antenna array offline okay I guess now it's time to start heading up to get to the bridge there is still oh incoming email coming for you but yeah there is still this door that needs to be opened is this some sort of secret wait a minute that thing's alive <laughs> holy shit Whew. oh email Already got it. Mostly. Will it Ritchie is our best shot at figuring out that unique code. He was stationed on engineering. See if he's still alive. Once you have the code, head to the reactor core. Get some advanced radiation protection, or at the least, a hell of a lot of detox. Enter the code inside the reactor core. Throw the switch, and the destruct signal from Earth will start the countdown. Get to the flight deck and use the code 001 to open the light pods in one of the flight bays. I'll see you outside in a few months. That message was really interesting because I noticed it didn't mention going up to security or the bridge whatsoever. It just said go down to the reactor, start the self-destruct, and that's what Triop wants us to do. That would probably help them cover up the whole thing, just blowing up the station. They could just claim it was a faulty power core or something. Yeah, I'm almost certain that there's multiple endings. It sounds like at least two endings. One where you blow up the station and one where you defeat Shodan by taking the isolinear chip to the bridge. Yeah, I think instead of going to the reactor and blowing up the station, I want to try going up to security and see if I can get to the bridge from there. But I'm going to save that for the next episode. Hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we'll go up to security and see what I can do.